there was already an apparent sign that Rachel Grome and Richard Salvatore had moved out of their Rybrook townhouse. Numerous trash bags and old moving boxes piled up here in the driveway. And when I tried to get an answer, no one came to the door. And I never have idea this uh, something something like that was happening over there, you know. Christian Lopez and others who live on Roanoke Avenue were quick to notice it was awfully busy at number 33. Well, I saw a lot of cars, new cars, a lot of different cars. Rybrook police were called. They began an investigation, learning the couple was part of a case in neighboring Harrison. The Harrison investigation, you know, brought up the, the Craigslist uh, ad, and, and from that we just kind of, you know, did our, did our, our leg work. Police say this was the couple's Craigslist page, one of two touting a hot non-pro college girl trying to make extra tuition money. There are several risque pictures and the claim that she would be hosting until 2 p.m. You know, we sent in an undercover officer into the house. They uh, made contact through the Craigslist ad. Um, they uh, had an appointment. They went into the condo and, and made the arrest. 23-year-old Rachel Grome and 45-year-old Richard Salvatore are now facing prostitution charges. Police believe, though, the husband and wife had fallen on hard times. There was no uh, job on the books for them, so there's, they had to get their income somehow. And you think they were doing it through the prostitution? Yeah. Just to make the ends meet? Well, just to, you know, as a way to uh, support themselves. I mean, this used to be a quieter, quieter, very quiet um, street. It's kind of sad that it's even coming down to that. I'm just hoping that it gets better.